Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in to Libra's Way. So I'm going to be doing a crypto check-in. Oh, I forgot, I have to get a note. Okay, so I want to kind of do a little bit of a an intro, hoping this actually, that I have enough juice. If I don't, this will be part one of crypto check-in. But, um, you know, I kind of want to talk about where where the economy is going. And I feel like the past one to two days, um, and I'm pre-recording this. This is for, this is being recorded um, in May, or I'm sorry, April 21st. So Thursday, April 21st to be released on Saturday. But something feels different. It feels like something has changed energetically. I can't quite put a finger on it. I think it also has to do with the missile launch test. And yes, we know that like a big part of what is controlling the market right now is the war. There's a lot of fear. And I think we're going to see temporary boom. It's going to be propped up in the coming one to two months, Gemini season feels very important and strong. But, you know, like I was talking to my father, we were walking Clifford, my dog. Check me out on Instagram, watch the reel, you'll see Clifford, he's very cute, he's a lab. Um, and we were talking about how, how we had this, what is it called, stagflation post Cold War in the 19s from the 1960s to 80s interest rates were double digits they were super high 10 15 percent you know and they never they never dropped they didn't drop until the 90s when the dot-com boom hit and the bubble and it crashed and everything kind of switched up but it feels like like we have amazon producing so much there's a lot of ex excessive global consumerism that we have been kind of over perpetuating in our life now i don't think it's going to completely slow down but i think that it's going to influence things i think that we are going to see mass hikes in interest rates i think i think we're coming towards a, some sort of a thing there where, you know, when the interest rates rise super high, it's definitely an era where, you know, inflation is just kind of, there, everything is stagnant. So I feel like there could be something like that happening because I think in a lot of ways, history repeats itself. We're seeing this version of like a volume two to the Cold War. And I think crypto is going to be hindered by this somehow. I've mentioned this multiple times before, but you know, the other thing we talked about was how the industrial revolution, America is built on the industrial revolution, on the concept that we build things, right? That we are in this place where this is the theme of America, right? Like we invent things, we build things, we have tech startups that can globalize, you know, humanity in some way. Capitalism is America. America is all about industry. It's all about allowing for people's ideas, their concepts to just flourish if they are in the right place at the right time with the right supporters and people, the right amount of money, or just pure luck, right? I think this is carrying into, I think this is just, this snippet is just a little bit more in regards to why, why we're headed there. And, you know, what do we do to prevent our, prevent this from becoming so extreme that it's like, you know, that it's kind of like, it, it can't be so extreme. It can't be something where 
you know, it's, it, it's going to be a level of extreme because I think too many things have been too propped up, too many situations where, you know, too many people are succeeding in certain things. And, but, you know, we have to re remember that passive income, that index funds, that this concept of like bonds, these have all been around since like 1800, since the time that we really began, okay? I think that just things, yeah, there's a level of complication that I feel with the crypto market and with how things are going. Let's see. This doesn't necessarily feel specific about coins. This feels like the overall energy of the market itself, okay? Letting go, it feels like people are releasing. People are starting to kind of gauge like where this is going or they're trying to currently they're trying to gauge where this is going because they know that something is that there's a shakeup coming okay and I heard here comes the boom I just heard that in my head right now so I feel like we're going to have some sort of a boom very soon like I said Gemini season feels really important for crypto with for money to like start flowing into the market so it could be sorry guys i'm trying to like light my little sage here and i <laughs> anyways it's may gemini season feels incredibly important so be prepared because i think something is coming towards may early june but i'm telling you right now forewarned is forewarned this temporary boom is going to be something where if you can get your money, if I can get my money out, if I can see, t take some of my big profits out, I'm, <laughs> heck yeah, I'm doing it because I'm telling you right now, there's, there, we are going towards some sort of a crash. I don't know what, I don't know what that means. I don't know what type it's going to be. I just know it's coming and it's going to change. It's going to shake things up. But I also have a feeling that this crash is going to be the final countdown. It's the final step. And I'm going to keep saying it because it feels like people need to know. People need to be reminded. People who, you know, this is also a motivational channel, you know, um, in regards to like, you can do this. This is, be confident in who you are. Be confident in even when people have a lot to say or they say, you know, this is weird that you watch this tarot channel or this is weird, you know, that a Libra's way is like, you know, a tarot reader or whatever. It's not normal, right? Like, I'm so sick of this. It's just like, we are in this place at this point in our world where like, you can be whoever you want to be. Doesn't mean that we agree with it, that it's moral right to most of the world it doesn't mean that like they that it needs to, that it's agreed with but what is important is that people realize like this is this is your life right you are choosing your life you're gonna change your world for the better because you are doing the research look at this you are doing the research with communication, with numerology precision, and destiny, right? You're changing your fate. You're making sure that your fate is in your hands, not in anybody else's hands, right? You are make, taking control of the situation because when all is said and done, you know, all we can do is control our circumstances and nobody else's you have the power to do whatever works for you like period and i just want you to remember that that crypto is that ability sure there might be some tough times ahead right with crypto with work actually you know if interest rates continue to heighten there could be some situations that come about um, that are difficult because of the market. Yes, this is a great market to also 
ask for more money with numbers here. And it is a numbers game. That's what I'm hearing. But, you know, people who are trying to become an employee, this is your market. This is your, this is something for you. Like, take advantage of it. Even if, you know, this is something where it feels like people are going to, like, between April and October to the end of the year, I feel like a lot of people are going to be landing their dream jobs. They're going to be in position where, like, they have put in the work. Their goals are being realized. And it's coming together in a way that changes everything. Changes everything about, like, you knew. Yeah, look at this sudden wealth. I'm telling you guys, it's... It's not only money from crypto, it's career wise. It's, and of course, if you get more money from your job, it's more money to invest in crypto and your 401k, in your lifestyle, in your brokerage account to become the privileged lady, to become this person that has everything they want. So again, I think that 2022 is a very important year. We are we are embracing this new energy okay we are embracing all of the beauty that that comes with this you know this is going to change everything i i feel strongly like there's something that is going to change and i think it has it starts in may and you know but there is like I said, also, there's forewarned is forewarned. We are in a position or a situation where times are strange, okay? Pluto return. People forgot. Pluto return happened. 2-22-2022 portal. The day that that happened, Putin pretty much launched this war, right? Everybody went into, like, meltdown mode because nobody wants this. But... It's also, this is not only about Putin, this is not only about the war, this is about us at war with who we are and as a humans in this world, humanity. What does, if there's a message that you could send to the alien friends, neighbors, whatever, across the galaxy about who we are, right? We don't want to be known as warmongers, we want to be known as creative souls which they see us as but creative souls who come up with solutions to problems when something happens we create a solution and i'm saying this because i feel like crypto is a solution to a big problem the most successful people in this world and most likely intergalactically find solutions to their problems okay they prepare. They don't just sit there and allow for these things to happen, right? They take action. Problems and figuring out a solution. This is how, how things change and adjust. Everything's okay. Don't worry. It's all working out in a beautiful way. You know, I feel very strongly that we will see People are going to be very happy. Perfect timing. I think a lot of people, if you play your cards right, there will be a lot of people that have windfalls because we have sudden wealth here. And this is all about like this time, this upcoming few weeks and like kind of what we're supposed to expect into fall. I mean, this energy just continues. It's it's kind of timeless, right? That These readings are timeless. But... For the next two to three weeks into the solar eclipse and lunar eclipse energy, this is a time where we're going to start seeing pre preparation for the boom because I keep hearing, here comes the boom. I'm looking at a teddy bear I have. I know this is very random, at an animal. They showed me on the teddy bear it says, love you. They do weird things to me like this, where they say, 
look, you has three letters, love has four letters, three to four weeks. This is like a weird way of how they tell me things sometimes. Or like they say, yeah, look at this. It's like, it's there, it's a sign to show you. I've never thought about this before. Like, I'm not just sitting here like, oh, ha, let me think about things this way. Like, who does that? I'm just saying. I'm not sitting here like thinking that way. But right, but my guides show me things in ways that are different from how we as human beings in this on this earth in the 3D. Oh my gosh. Another sign. If you hear the noise of this truck, it's the alarm went off three to four weeks, yo, three to four weeks. I'm telling you right now, the alarm is going off outside. There is a car that just had the alarm go off right after I said three to four weeks. This boom is about to happen. Whatever this thing is, it's going to happen. It's going to shake everything up and I'm getting out. I'm getting it f out of whatever that is i'm putting my money away from taxes that's a sign that's a sign to me i don't know what y'all are doing but three or four weeks is when it's starting so i am i think this i think we're about to have a bull run i do i think we're about to have a bull run after this lunar eclipse let's see i think and i'm gonna do a solar eclipse and lunar eclipse special readings which will be like general collective readings. They're not going to be crypto. They're not going to be love. They're going to be general readings. Whatever comes out, comes out. That's weird. And it's a temporary, you know, it lasted for like 30 seconds. The, the like alarm that went off and then somebody ran outside and turned it off. But I was like, hmm, it was a short boom. These booms, it must be that there's a, a short Bull run. There's something that happens where, you know, it doesn't last for more than like two, three weeks, two weeks, and then it dies. I think that's what's about to happen. That's my opinion. Dude, the Fates Treasure Island. Oh my God. Treasure Island, y'all. Treasure Island came out with sudden wealth three to four weeks from now. Three to four weeks from now is when Gemini season starts. Now, Let's test the theory and see if Gemini card comes out. If we see 10 of Pentacles, Gemini card, I want to see what happens. But I'm, I mean, I'm already convinced Gemini season. I've always, I've been saying this, the <coughs> Q2, April, May, oh shit, you guys. Oh my God, you guys. Ah, sorry. G-O-D, I'm so sorry. Okay. King of Cups, yo the lovers this is gemini card yo i didn't do you saw you saw my shuffles you saw it live i didn't do anything i told everybody last october i said quarter two of of crypto this is when we're going to see the move and the tower came in divine intervention money's coming y'all i'm convinced three to four weeks gemini season starts may 23rd to june 23rd this is when this shit starts. It, it pops off during solar eclipse season and it goes end of April, end of April. I told everybody Q2, Q2 is when that money takes off. Be ready. Don't say I didn't tell you so because I freaking told you so. If this happens, I'm just saying, I am just saying you heard it here first, folks. Nowhere else. Bye.